But first, let me paint you a picture of what the world looked like before everything went wrong. It's 13,000 years ago. The last ice age is ending. Massive ice sheets that covered half of North America are finally melting. Sea levels are rising. The climate is getting warmer and more stable. Life is honestly pretty good. In North America, you've got these incredible animals everywhere. We're talking woolly mammoths with tusks 16 feet long, ground sloths that weigh four tons, dire wolves hunting in packs, ancient camels, giant beavers the size of bears, and these armadillo-like creatures called glyptodonts with shells you could literally use as a shelter. And then there's humans, the Clovis people. These weren't primitive cave dwellers. They were sophisticated hunters with technology that wouldn't be matched for thousands of years. Their spear points, absolutely beautiful, perfectly crafted. Archaeological evidence shows they had trade networks spanning thousands of miles. Everything is trending upward. Evolution is doing its thing. And then, everything stops. Around 12,800 years ago, the Earth's climate crashes. And I don't mean it gets a little colder. I mean temperatures in North America drop by 15 degrees Celsius in some regions, in just a few decades. That's like going from New York to Alaska overnight. This event has a name, the Younger Dryas. Scientists named it after a little Arctic flower called Dryas that suddenly started showing up in places where it had no business being, because those places had turned into frozen wastelands. For 1,000 years, the planet is locked in this deep freeze glaciers that had been retreating. They start advancing again. The warm, stable climate that was allowing human civilizations to flourish? Gone. And when it's finally over, when the ice retreats again around 11,800 years ago, the damage is done. Over 35 generations of large mammals, extinct, the Clovis culture, vanished without a trace. The archaeological record literally shows a black layer in the soil, and above that layer, everything is different. 